the day, that's just my past. Money buy anything, but loyalty is something you just don't have. Self love ran deep. The support that you give is the love that you brag. Love who up on my mind. Gotta get my mind right, gotta get that. Today, we're gonna be doing things Kylie's way. Let's get into it. What's up, everybody, and welcome to my channel, Glam Vamp. I'm going to be recreating Kylie's everyday makeup look. I am going to link the video to her everyday look that she posted down below and I'm going to also be showing you little clips from the video as we go. This routine really takes me no longer than like 10 minutes. Start with my foundation. I used to start with my brows, now I start with my foundation. It's um, a Kylie Cosmetics brush in number 6. I like this brush because I like how it, um, you know, really gets my foundation in there. So I'm kind of going to like mix it with my brush. Go ahead and apply. I definitely feel like this is my, this combo is like my perfect match. So I just like to like blend it in really well. So I have two um, liquid foundations that I use. I mix them together. I have this one, which is my Avon True Foundation. This one is in the color Soft Honey. And then I have my NYX Stay Matte But Not Flat Liquid Foundation. And this color is ivory. So these two products, I usually mix them together. And then I have like my desired skin tone foundation. Okay guys, so we're gonna take some of this and she said just put like a thin layer, nothing too crazy. So I'm gonna start brushing it in. So what I'm gonna do after is I'm gonna go in with my sponge. Okay, so now that I got a nice thin layer of foundation, I'm gonna use a beauty blender and just Blend it in so there's no streaks from the brush. And we're gonna just blend in all this foundation. I'm gonna blend, blend, blend. <laughs> okay, so next step is my concealer. I'm using shade Maple right now. I don't like to use too much. And then I have some little imperfections there. I'm gonna do like just a little on my forehead and down my nose. So I see she's adding it like right here. She also takes it up here. Yep. She actually takes it pretty much down here a little bit. She also puts some on her chin. She puts a little bit on her forehead down her nose and overall on just any places where she has dark spots so now I'm gonna go ahead and blend 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 we're gonna blend all of this in mm-hmm mm -hmm, girl we're gonna be looking like baddies all 2023. You already know. YouTubing has always been a dream for me, but I've just recently really been taking it so serious and putting in so much work into it because like this is really something that I love to do. And now that I have more access to things that I can use to be better as a YouTuber, it's just like, I don't have an excuse to not chase my dream. I always wanted to be a YouTuber and this is like a dream of mine. So just a month ago, I had 20 subscribers and now I have 400 and something subscribers. I'm grateful. God bless me, everybody, all my loved ones, everyone out there watching me. Thank you, thank you. Cause this, none of this will be possible without God. So I like to do my brows next. She goes and does her brows. So she's using her Kylie Cosmetics brow pencil. And I will be using some pomade that you can get from your local beauty supply store. Let me show you guys. It's called I Envy Kiss. This one is in the color chocolate brown. I like to just do them pretty fast and more natural. So I start with lining underneath and getting that shape. 
so usually she brushes them up when she outlines the bottom of her brow and then she brushes them down when she's doing the top of her brow so that's exactly what we're gonna do right now extending out i like my brow to be a little bit longer on the end i'm going to just outline my brow on the bottom the way kylie said Kylie did say she likes an extended brow. She likes a long arch at the end. So I will be doing that. Dang, my eyebrows are like naturally dramatic. But um, we got this. We got this. We're going to create this Kylie look, okay? So I'm going to just extend it out. Okay. Okay. Boom. Brows like frame your face and it's just so important to have bomb brows so i'm gonna do the same thing that i did here but i'm gonna do it on this eye now she brushes up and then she starts outlining the bottom of her brow so then after that kylie goes and she brushes her eyebrows down and she goes and out outlines the top of her brow the way she wants it to be. And now I'm going to take a little bit of product. And I'm going to just outline the top of the brow. It's kind of hard to see in this angle. But more or less. More or less. I'm not going to put too much product. I'm going to brush my na my eyebrows naturally, like, in the shape that they go in to see what we have accumulated. So this is actually pretty cute. It looks like my real eyebrow fully, but I have a little sum sum there, you know? So yeah, we're going to repeat the same step that we did on here, and we're going to do it on this brow. What kind of music you guys jam to? If we're talking Spanish, huh, I'm going straight to Rosalia. That is my girl. I love her. I love Rosalia. After we follow those steps on both eyebrows, we should have something like this on both sides. This eyebrow, I have a scar, so it's not gonna look exactly the same, you know? But I'll try a bit. <laughs> So, this is, uh, I'm loving it. Okay, pretty good. Let's go into the next step of Kylie Jenner's everyday routine. Usually after this step, Kylie goes in and she uses her brow sticks. Since I do not have Kylie cosmetic products, unfortunately, I'm going to use concealer. So this is the concealer that I'm going to use. We're using the NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop Concealer in the color Light Ivory. I love this concealer. It gives me like a nice little like matte finish. And this is also the same concealer that I'm using on my face as well. This is really thin at the tip. And I usually just brush it on here. And then I would go in and I'll start lining up my brows. So according to Kylie's routine, she usually puts like a little bit of her brow stick right here to lighten it up. And little by little, she takes it to the front. Baby, so I'm gonna just blend this inwards towards my eye so it doesn't look like a blatant white line you know loving it and then we're gonna do the same thing on this side I actually kind of love it very natural very nice I love it not too crazy you know but I'm always open-minded to different types of looks. If you guys have any recommendations or anything like that, you can drop it down in the comment section below. And I will I respond to almost all my comments. You guys comment as much as you want and I will respond as much as you want. <laughs> Seriously. She usually takes a brush that kind of looks similar to this brush, but a little bit smaller to blend it out. 
Let me get some water. So after that, Kylie goes into her eyeshadow look. I'm just gonna keep on brushing these brows every here and there in this video, just to make sure they're standing, you know? I'm gonna do like a two second eye look because this is what I do when I'm rushing. So I'll mix topaz and tiger eye. Um, it's like a cool tone brown and like a warm tone brown and I put this right in my crease. Really all you need is like one swipe and I kind of blend it out. Now we're gonna go into the eye look. So Kylie said she usually uses like a warm tone brown and a cool tone brown. So that's exactly what I'm gonna use. She said she usually goes inside her crease with those two colors. And she usually just does it with one, one stroke and then she just blends it out to make that little soft, neutral, natural ombre. All right, so we're gonna go in and use our Nude LA Colors eyeshadow palette. We're gonna go and take this warm brown and take a little bit of this cold brown and we're gonna apply that into our crease and just blend Noise and I was over here on the floor of the living room, and there's a crack. Yeah, this is crack word. And I'm what do you want to eat? I don't know, but first, I wanted to come to show off my outfit and how I had it on today. <laughs> Baddie. And then, so I'm gonna take this color that's right here. I don't know either. <sighs> Stressful. I'm just like, it's, this is this should be Emmanuel's job to decide this. <laughs> this blends all of this the top out you can already see the difference I'm gonna take Jasper this light color and just put it in the center of my lid just to on both sides and then blend it out. I feel like it just gives me like a, gives me like a faux cut crease. She takes a little bit of like a white, white beigey color. Let me see. So she usually takes like a white beige color, kind of like this, kind of like the color concealer that you use. Whatever kind of color concealer you use, that's the kind of eyeshadow color you'd need for this part of the video so she adds it right here in the center and that's for her little faux crease it looks so pretty okay there's my blender i see you which is like a really dark brown i'm gonna take the tiniest bit I'm gonna put it in with this flatter brush, which is number 13. And then after I place it exactly where I want it to be, I'm gonna take my bigger brush, which is number 15, and I'm just gonna do a quick blend. She takes an angle brush kind of like this. She takes the chocolate brown color and she applies it like in here. I believe this is giving like more dimension to the eye look. And she makes her little line that she makes with this angled brush. So I'm gonna take this brush from earlier and I'm gonna just blend it out. Wow, that looks very cute. After we do that, she goes in and does her liner. I'm going to use a pencil liner, black pencil liner, to do my line. I don't need to see, baby. I like to love me. I like to love me. 
So I'm looking forward to how this look is going to look and maybe I'll be changing my routine. <laughs> she says she likes a really extended um, long eyeliner wing as well because she likes to make her eyes look a little bit longer. And then clown neck. Kylie's line is so perfect. I need that liner. I need that liquid liner. Whichever one that is, I need it. So let me take my concealer brush and just swoop up. Since with this eyeliner pencil, I'm never going to get a perfect wing. <laughs> Pretty satisfied pretty satisfied her line actually looks a little bit longer okay so now we're gonna repeat the same thing but on this side i'm gonna fill in these little empty spots i see that moment don't you ever feel like what if i would have never touched that like it would have been still perfect Ooh, i love it i'm loving it actually in love wow absolutely beautiful i'm gonna mix um my bronzers tequila tan and toasty and i'm gonna do this to contour my face and add some warmth back in here so after she does her eyeliner she goes in with her contour her tequila tan and toasty bronzer is what she uses. Me, I will be using my Palladio matte bronzer. So she's kind of, she's doing her contour like right about here. And then she goes under here. And then she goes down here because why not? And then we just do it everywhere. Yeah, perfect. So I'm gonna get my blush brush. Usually I use this brush for my blush. Um, With this look, I'm feeling that maybe like a reddish kind of tone would be more nice for this look. And I only feel like that just because it's just giving me that vibe. I'm gonna take my favorite blush brush, which is number three. I'm gonna use this palette, my Beauty Treats palette. I believe my, I believe we got this from like Marshalls or something. I'm gonna take my blush brush and I'm gonna take this color right here. It's called Amber. It's like a reddish kind of color. It, she's putting it like right above her contour line so that's exactly what i'm gonna do she also puts some on her nose and you know everywhere <laughs> okay i think it's time for some highlighter i am gonna use my favorite shade clean drip looks like this and I'm going to do it right just on my, to the top right there. I'm not going to drag it onto my cheek because I don't like highlighter on my cheek. Um, now I'm going to take a smaller brush and do right down the center of my nose. Mm, maybe above my lip a little bit. So then Kylie goes into using her highlighter. So this is the highlighter that I use usually every day. The Nika K shimmering glow bronzer well oh sorry sheer and glow bronzer but i usually just like mix it all together and it makes this beautiful like natural rosy glow and i just use this for highlighter that's it so we're gonna go and take all the colors and apply it right where she's saying she says she only applies it to her upper cheekbone not on her cheek just right here that's where she applies that, right here, and that's it. You can already see my face naturally has a glow right here. I didn't even put nothing here. <laughs> so 
So she puts her highlighter like right there. So I'm just gonna take the white color with my little brush. And I'm just gonna apply this on my nose area. This is where she applies it. Like that. She puts a little bit on top of her lip too. Usually what I do is I usually extend my highlighter. I put it on my nose here. I also put it under here as well. And I put it here, probably a little bit on my forehead and a little bit on my chin. And that's what I do. Center only because I like really like, like an ombre lip. So after that, Kylie goes in with her lip kit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be using my Avon lipstick, which is kind of a similar color, but it's a little bit more of a nudie brown color instead of a pinkish, you know, like a Kylie tone. And also it's not matte, it's a shiny color. So I'm going to go and I'm just going to dab it in the middle. So I'm going to take some lip gloss. It's a brown sparkly lip gloss that I have. And I'm just gonna go like that. The reason why I put most of um, the lipstick on the middle is because Kylie said she likes like an ombre kind of look. So I put most of the lipstick in the middle and then the sides are more like lighter pink. As you can see, so now that we've done that, Kylie, oh, I actually forgot a step. Kylie tells us to let our hair loose. So that's exactly what we're going to do. <laughs> yep. So after we do that, Kylie goes in and she puts her mascara on. Let's see. Because I have these two mascaras that I love. This one, which is my Essence Lash Princess. And then this one, which is Extreme Length Nika K New York. And um, this one is more for like volumizing and for separate. Like if you want like a separate lash look. Not really like a full, fuller look, but more of a longer look. This one is like more of a fuller look, but um, as far as length, I could say that this one is actually way better. And this one has the price on it. This one only cost me $3.99 at a local beauty supply store. Oh, I dropped it. So what I'm going to do is for my bottom lashes, I'm going to use this one. So it's not, you know, I'm not going for a full bottom lash look. So... I'm going to use this for my bottom lashes, my volumizing one, because I like a separate bottom lash look. Kylie doesn't really show herself putting the mascara on in her video, so I'm just going to assume that this is what she does. Now for the top lashes, I'm going to actually use um, both of them, actually. Mm -hmm, yep. So I'm going to go in with the volumizing one first. Just to get them that volume that I want. So I put the volumizing mascara on. Now I'm going to go in with my Essence Last Princess. And this one is actually for volume and curl. But to me, it gives volume. It gives curl. It gives fullness. It gives. It gives. Period. It gives. You can see the difference. Look. Do you see that? Okay, so we are officially done with the Kylie routine, everyday routine. How do you guys like the look? So we're done with the look. This is so pretty. I actually love this look like I love the routine the way it made my face look versus my natural routine I actually might try doing this routine for now on just cuz like it looks I don't know it just my face just looks so much brighter I don't know how to explain it and everything is just put together very well 
I love it. Thank you, Kylie Jenner, for your beautiful makeup tutorial. Everybody stay tuned for the next video. I think I'm going to probably do either a rhinestone makeup tutorial or I'll probably do another video similar to this one. So everybody comment down below. Let me know what you want to see in the future. Everybody subscribe to my channel. Everybody turn the post notifications on. Like, share, subscribe. Thank you all for joining me today. God bless you. And again, thank you so much, Kylie, for doing your video because you inspire lots of women like me to feel beautiful. And that's just that. Have a great day, everybody. Subscribe. By this mm -hmm. tutorial, I hope you learned something. And I will see you guys next time. Fit away, fit away, fit away, fit away. I'm not the same that I've been before. Done change lanes you never did before. So I'm stopping by.